Okay, so I'm sitting here with Maria Sharapova, and I'm so excited to ask you all these questions. Thank you for being here. Yes. And so I'm going to start. Are we ready? It's yeah, not a cool. rapid fire. You can take your time with this I don't know if I'm ready. One. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. All right. So, who is the most fun tennis player on the tour? Hmm. I think Novak Djokovic. If you had played in any era that's gone by, who would be a dream mixed doubles partner? Mm. I think I would have loved to play with John McEnroe. Really? I would have, yeah, I think we're we're total opposites of <laughs> the way that we act on the court. So it would be fun to see his frustrations come out and then me trying to calm him down and <laughs> trying to stay positive. So I think that would be that would be a fun combo. Where is the coolest place you've ever played a game of tennis? I've played tennis in many places around the world. So it's really hard. One. It's hard to choose one. I mean, I'd say the most prestigious is center court at Wimbledon. Of course. Right. Of course. Okay. Describe yourself in one word. <laughs> okay. Um, describe myself. It's always really hard, right? We need at least like five or ten. Well, I need like 25. <laughs> I like but, that. Um, that's really hard. Um, uh, let's skip this one. <laughs> you can just say... Well, you could just say number. <coughs> honest. And, honest. Okay. Yeah. What is the strangest rumor you've ever heard about yourself? It's a rumor. Um, I mean, there have been a few. <laughs> I'd say probably when they say you're pregnant and you're like, <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah, while well, you're competing. Yeah. It's very random, right? <laughs> it's so random. Okay. <laughs> what is the craziest thing a fan has ever said or done for you? Um, I have pretty well behaved fans, but there are some fans that have actually. Um, made tattoos of my name and my signature on their body, which I think is um, very spontaneous, <laughs> very dedicated. Um, so I'm very thankful, but I do think they're crazy and I think they should tone it down. <laughs> but other than that, they've been pretty respectful. Who was your idol growing up and why? My idol? Um, as a anyone. tennis player or anyone? anyone? Oh, um, I think on the court it was Monica Seles. I, I, yeah, I loved her attitude and her passion for the game and um, and the strengths that she had on the court. Um, I always admired Audrey Hepburn. I loved the images of Audrey Hepburn and Marilyn Monroe. Um, yeah, and what they stood for and their personalities. And, yeah. I love that. Very strong women. Yes. 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 Okay. What is the first big thing you bought yourself with your tennis earnings? First big thing. Um, I think it was a house for my parents and I. That's pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it wasn't a big house, but yeah. Wow. Congratulations. Yeah. That's very really nice. You. Okay. A non-tennis sports star you admire? Michael Jordan. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. A sports movie you've loved? Hmm. Um, oh, I love boxing movies. Yeah. I think those are always very emotional and very strong and, um, there's always a great story around boxing, um, you know, kind of coming from behind and thinking you're the underdog and then coming through and um, yeah, there's a lot of ferociousness in that. Does that get you kind of motivated? Yeah, I don't watch too many of them, but when I do, I feel there's a certain power that you get inside of yourself after watching one of them. Of course. All right. A current song you struggle to get out of your mind? Um, well, right now it's hello. <laughs> <laughs> Is that because of dubs? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I do a lot of fashion in India. Okay. My, my, my whole show is based on fashion, okay. and I know that you have Sugar Pogo, which is really cool. Thank you. So when did you get into fashion, and why? Um, well, I've yeah, I've loved clothes, and I've loved, um, I guess, kind of expressing personality through clothes mm -hmm. when I started working with Nike ever since I was a really a, a young girl, mm -hmm. and um, it kind of... It was the first time. And then I shot a campaign um, for Tag Heuer with Patrick de Marchier. And I was like, well, this is incredible because you get to um, wear beautiful clothes and you come into a character and exactly. you're in front of a camera and you get to play somebody else that you're not in your everyday life, which Amazing. is fun for so a short fun. period of time. And, yeah. um, and then I, when I went through an injury, um, you know, I had shoulder surgery and I came to a point where I thought, well, tennis isn't going to run forever. And there's going to be a time where I'm going to have um, other things that I want to be a part of. And um, I started my candy brand. And, um, and yeah, and little by little, it, it's evolving in, into chocolate and, and hopefully fashion soon. How long does it take you to get ready in your court life and just when you're getting ready for a normal yeah, well, kind of outing? Court, court life is pretty simple. simple. <laughs> yeah, it's just like, bam. Yeah, it's just hair, up, hair like, up in a ponytail. And, and do you yeah. have any, like... Um, 
things that you do that you know is superstitious kind of things yeah, that you not do. Not really in the locker room, no. I no. just yeah, I just put on my outfit and put my hair in a ponytail, put some sunscreen on and I'm I'm ready. You're but ready. yeah, in my off core life you definitely I mean I'm a girl, you yeah. know how it is. <laughs> you know? We take a little bit extra time to get ready. But I'm I'd say I'm pretty fast. You're pretty yeah, fast. Yeah, on average I'm pretty fast. Oh that's nice. Yeah. Guys like I, that. I don't like to wait well, I don't really care what they <laughs> like, but guys yeah. like that. But they take longer than us these days. <laughs> Yeah. I know they got a lot of products these days. They got days. a lot of products these days. We can got a lot, a lot of options. <laughs> they got a lot of options. Yeah. Okay, well, thank you thank so you. much for being with us. Thanks for having me. And all me. the best for your matches. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. Okay, thank you.